There are many ways to evaluate a stock or portfolio, from price to earnings to price to book. The problem is these don't always show the true picture of how a company is doing. A company may have lots of assets and high revenue, but operate at a loss. That can make a risky investment. Nothing is guaranteed, but investing in companies with the highest free cash flow, after paying expenses, interest, taxes, and long-term investments, may be a wiser choice. Such companies are more likely to survive tough times and reinvest their spare cash for long-term growth, to grow their dividends, or to buy back stock. Pacer ETFs created the Cash Cow series so you can invest in the best companies based on free cash flow yield, which is free cash flow divided by enterprise value. Using a rules-based methodology, we screen a broad-based index and only invest in the top companies based on a free cash flow yield screen. What's more, we rebalance and rescreen the funds on a set schedule to ensure the companies still deserve to be included. So you get quality companies with the highest free cash flow yield that may grow dividends and produce better earnings over time. Because of market volatility, it's wise to rebalance a portfolio regularly, but when doing it on your own, you may have to pay taxes on the gains. Fortunately, with Pacer ETFs, we automatically rebalance the fund for you with a goal to distribute little to no capital gains. Investing is about maintaining your lifestyle well into retirement. Incorporating the cash cow strategies may help you get there by investing in quality companies with the highest free cash flow yield. You've worked hard for your money. Now it's time to make it work hard for you. Check out Pacer's Cash Cows ETFs, offering exposure to the U.S. and global markets. To learn more about Pacer ETFs, visit PacerETFs.com or talk to your financial advisor today. An investment in the funds is subject to investment risk, including the possible loss of principal. Pacer ETF shares may be bought and sold on an exchange through a brokerage account. Brokerage commissions and ETF expenses will reduce investment returns. There can be no assurance that an active trading market for ETF shares will be developed or maintained. The risks associated with these funds are detailed in the prospectus and could include factors such as concentration risk, currency exchange rate risk, equity market risk, foreign securities risk, geographic concentration risk, high portfolio turnover risk, large, mid, and small capitalization investing risk, new fund risk, non-diversification risk, other investment companies risk, passive investment risk, style risk, tracking risk, sector risk, and or special risk of exchange-traded funds.